Now, my family, a couple of days ago, Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, made a cameo appearance advertising Clever Blends, where Meghan is an investor. My family, she invested money in Clever Blends. And my family, Meghan's cameo appearance here has prompted so many, you know, global reactions from people across the world. And uh, I even saw my family, a TV show, Fox 29, my family, in Philadelphia, in Philadelphia, my family, called Two Mics and a Bill, also reacting to Megan making a cameo appearance, my family, for a video promoting Clever Blends. And my family, I want you to hear exactly my family, what they said about my family, Megan's cameo appearance for Clever Blends. My family, please kindly just please hear this, my family. Please. Formerly, Meghan Markle. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. She was, you know, she's chilling. She gave up the whole princess thing, but has been largely chilled in books and speaking tour and whatever. So she recently popped up in a coffee company commercial. And gotta get that work, man. Was just like kind of on the side in the commercial. They were making a joke out of it. They just labeled her as the technology person who's oh. helping the company run. And then they walked by her, and people all noticed her in the commercial. Does she have a line? Do you know? She. No I don't line. think she says anything. She's they just, just walk by and they point That's her out funny. and That's show her funnier yeah. right. as you're moving around. And she was like the intern in this commercial. Even okay. funnier. I love it. So as you put it out there. People immediately, because that's what people do on social media, they started talking about, so what are you, the princess of coffee now? Yep. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. This is ridiculous. A handful of people were like, good for you, just going out, like, having fun. But she's, she's taking a lot of heat for it. My initial response is, like, mind, mind your business. Like, I thought it was funny. I right. thought it that's was creative. Funny. Right. But why are we slamming her for that? I'm not slamming her at all. Not at all. I think she's fantastic. She's one of my favorite cups of coffee. <laughs> my family first of all allow me to just you know pause there for a second now my family whatever megan does it gets so so many global reactions my family megan is an influential person an influential family you know high profile person who no matter what she does you can guarantee Whatever she does, my family will get so, so many headlines. And the reason why these trolls online were basically going after Meghan Markle is because they don't want to see Meghan earning a living. They don't want that. They cannot stand it that Meghan, by leaving the royal family, by basically fleeing the UK, and refusing to put up with abuse and racism for a tiara. They can't stand seeing Megan living her life outside of the toxic farm. My family. Outside of the toxic monarchy. They just cannot be able to stand that. That Megan prefers that. My family. Living her life. You know, engaging in commercial adventures, my family. Rather than putting up with abuse and racism back in the UK in exchange for a tiara. You know, I even saw this, you know, my family told online me like, Megan, you could have been, been in the UK basically wearing tiaras and, uh, you know, basically inviting heads of state, you know, to, you know, a state banquet. My family, and I'm like, when Megan was back in the UK, weren't the media gloating Saying that William and uh, this person, what's her name, a family? Her name is uh, Angela Kelly. That they were united, saying that Meghan should have no access to the royal family's tiara collection. Why are they gloating when they heard that? When the royal family was saying that, you know what, Meghan should not have any kind of access to any tiara. My family, and now that Megan has fled the UK, now that she's living her life in California, they're like, Megan, you could have been there. You know? Wearing tiaras. 
inviting heads of state. My family, guess what? Megan even and Harry at the Invitos Games. They met up with heads of state. They met up with foreign diplomats. My family, Prince Harry was sitting practically at almost every single game with a defense minister from different countries. My family, with defense ministers, chatting with them, talking with them. However, some individuals will never be able to stand that Harry Meghan can be able to do that outside of the control of the farm. My family, they can't stand seeing Harry and Meghan independent. And I feel like independence is something very, very important for Prince Harry and Meghan. They must maintain their independence. And having their own money, paying their own bills, is key for Harry and Meghan to be able to maintain their independence. And clearly, that's what some individuals can't be able to stand. That's what some individuals don't like seeing that Harry and Meghan are making money. They know if Meghan promotes anything, it sells out. If Meghan wears anything, it sells out. And they don't want to see Meghan fully harnessing that power. My family, I mean, they always like to imply that somehow Meghan, by giving up that toxic life, she gave up so much. My family, what did Roti bring Meghan Markle? Meghan would pass a newspaper <laughs> family to watch her son get racially abused by the UK media when she was back in the UK. That's what Roti brought her. Roti, you're having senior members, Roe family, Charles and Kim Moulton, having concerns about the color of Harry Meghan's unborn child. That's what Roti brought Meghan Markle. And somehow, that is what, and somehow that is what Megan is supposed to miss. That's the letter that Megan is supposed to miss. You know? Or think about. I mean, like, why did you lose that life? You know, my family, it is key to some individuals, for some individuals to realize this, my family, and understand, and, and understand this. If you want someone to regret something, then abusing them is not the best way to make someone regret something. My family. For example, life in the royal family. When they were bullying and hounding Meghan Markle, to the point that my family, Meghan, was experiencing serious mental health struggles. My family. How can Meghan ever miss that life when you showed her that what she can expect from that life is bullying abuse and racism and that she can't defend herself from everything you are doing to destroy her so why would she miss that life her son was racially abused by someone working for the bbc not once ever has the royal family ever condemned racism towards megan archie or a little bit you want megan to regret that that life there back in the uk racism from the UK media and from the farm. Megan can't regret fleeing the UK because of the evil actions that were done to cause her pain and harm and suffering. Here's a tip. If you want someone to regret leaving, you know, a place you call a good place, perhaps you treat them well. No, 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 no. Not perhaps. You treat them well. If you treat them well, then for sure, they'll regret leaving. They'll regret fleeing the UK. But if you treat them appallingly constantly, you are reminding them of why they fled the UK. Because my family, for example, this mere campaign hasn't stopped. It continues the family. It continues. On the orders of senior members of the whole family. So then, how can Harry Meghan regret fleeing the UK if the farm continues its smear campaign against Harry Meghan? How can Harry and Meghan regret fleeing the UK? Yeah, my family, time and time again, we see how the UK media are writing articles with headlines to prop up William McKimmelton to the detriment of Harry and Meghan. So, 
how do you make her make and regret leaving when you're continuing to do that my family but clearly all this stuff all this you know mocking this attempt at spring saying that you know what this advertising is beneath you beneath royalty my family it is not it is not it is not my family and i do hope that harry megan are able to realize my family and see that advertising or any job that pays your bills my family be it content creation to, to my family working with netflix or other companies like for example harry's job at better up it is not beneath royalty my family it's above that some individuals are always gonna be better because they see that harry mega are able to pay their own bills are able to fund their own lifestyles and some individuals can never be able to stand seeing that that harry is able to pay his bills that megan is able to pay her bills some people's some people don't like seeing that my family so really i do hope that we see megan in more commercials my family if she's paid well then i do hope we keep on seeing megan markle in more and more commercials my family i i do really hope also please my family i hope we see them both you know engaging in being you know influencers my family promoting products or brands for money there is nothing beneath that nothing however Wikimedia media want harry megan to think that way that way they don't pursue influencing as a means of earning an income as a means of paying their bills my family harry megan have bills to pay and my family you know, I'm happy to see that Megan is working to pay her own bills. You know, to be basically, you know, independent financially on the farm. Not to depend on them, on Charles Marcy's, on William's Marcy's for a living. My family, I am happy about that. And under no circumstances should Harry Megan ever be at the mercy of Charles or William or anybody for money my family never but clearly that's what the UK media want to see harry megan begging for money my family they're never ever gonna see them my family please can you also continue my family hearing this <laughs> so everything <laughs> still stop. Still stop. No. but no i mean and even from like i love that she's doing this man like i truly believe you need to hold on to your independence no matter what exactly. the relationship is right exactly like yo like what's his name harry that's harry. what he married to <laughs> prince right he could wake up tomorrow and be like look i'm done with this i'm out now granted she'll probably get a nice little check out the deal but like she was an actress this is what she does this is her career exactly. like she's still young exactly you know what i mean hold on to your independence man keep working keep doing what yeah. you do exactly. you enjoy what you're doing do exactly. it and i don't care if that is a no liner in a commercial exactly 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 my family and really that's why i want to show you this video my family i fully agree with my family you know this guy my family has it i fully fully agree 100 percent my family with what mike Greenwich has said about Meghan Markle. It's important to be independent. It's important to pay your bills by yourself. That's very, very important, my family. Never be at the mercy of anyone. Some individuals, like the Kimberley family, they want to see Harry and Meghan begging. They want to see that, you know, to be pleased, to be happy. They want to see Harry and Meghan fail. They want to see them begging for money. That's what they want to see. My family, Harry Meghan must keep on working, engaging in more and more commercial ventures to be able to pay their bills. My family, regardless of what my family they do in the future, it's important that my family, they have their own money. It's important they pay their own bills. It's important that they, Harry Meghan, and also their kids, should never ever be at the mercy of Prince William 
or Charles or the UK public press for money. They must never be at their mercy. My family, you know, I remember how UK media will create those cartoon photos of Harry begging outside Buckingham Palace or Meghan, you know, holding the baby. You know, I, I remember those pictures meant to mock Harry Meghan when they announced that they were stepping back a senior member's royal family. You know, I remember those photos and they wanted to see them begging and they still want to see Harry Meghan begging. Even when UK media are hoping that somehow this smear campaign leads to Harry coming back to the UK, they always say how they want to see Prince Harry, you know, begging with a tail between his legs. Not just from one carnival of so called but who my family has said that from many of them have said the same thing. That's what they want to see. So my family, how do Harry and Meghan avoid that? They avoid that by continuing to do what they're doing, my family. And that is working. Working to pay their bills. Megan engaging in basically, you know, influencing or promoting a brand. That's my family, there's nothing shameful about that. What is of shame is seeing King Charles taking money from people who have passed away at his Duchy of Cornwall estate without my family, you know, leaving away my family. Now, the Duchy of Cornwall is now owned by Prince William. My family, it, 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 that is what I call shameful. My family, and then using that money to renovate your estates, your properties. It is disgraceful. Someone has worked all his life only for Charles to take their money. All their life they've worked. Sweat, my family, and their money for Charles to take all the money and use that money to renovate his estate. Now that is what I call shameful. Now that is what I call disgraceful. My family, Megan influencing to, to pay her bills, my family, that is not disgraceful. My family, I've always said really, if Megan were to relaunch her blog the TV family and just starts influencing, promoting brands, products, my family should become a billionaire. She'll be worth hundreds of millions of dollars, even more money than she and Harry already have made in the US. It will be so much more. And clearly, UK media, they know that very well. Because also they exploit Megan Markle themselves. My family, of how my family, I have seen them whenever Megan wears, you know, close my family. They know Megan's power. They know it sells out. I have seen this with my own two eyes, my family, of how they promote the clothes that Megan was wearing. And then they say, you know what? Daily Mail will earn a commission if you buy this cloth. However, to Megan, they're like, Megan, this is beneath royalty. Don't be an influence on my family to make understand that but to them they are using my family make and star power to make money for themselves by exploiting Megan Markle and then to make them they're like this is beneath royalty don't be an influencer however they are using that to make money my family they are using Megan to make money I have seen that so that's why I wanna I want to see Megan, my family, be really an influencer, make money for herself. And her own living and do what she loves to do. And honestly, I'm really sad that Megan basically will not be doing acting. I, I'm really, really sad about that. I'm really sad about that, my family, because you know, Megan is an amazing actress, and it's sad to hear that maybe she won't be you know, going back to acting my family. Even when signing a deal with WME, you know, they say that acting won't be an area of focus. And uh, my family, it's sad because I want to see Megan maybe in a movie or a series. I think it will be fun and amazing. And I do believe really that Hollywood would pay so much money to see, you know, Megan in a series or in a movie, my family. I do believe the offers would be 
too much. It would be so, so mammoth, man. But clearly, you know, Megan and Harry are interested in working behind the camera. And that's also my family okay. But as a fan, honestly, I would have loved to see even Megan in, you know, a movie or, a, or a, my family a series. Even Prince Harry. Both of them, my friend. Both of them, even doing movies together. I would have loved to see that. I would have paid money for that. But anyway, whatever they choose to decide to do, my family, I fully respect Prince Harry and Meghan. And I fully respect, you know, my family, their choice. And uh, my family, I do hope, I do cling on to hope that maybe my family will see, you know, Meghan in a movie or a series. Both Harry and Meghan, not just Meghan Markle, both Prince Harry and Meghan. I do cling on to hope that maybe... One day we'll see them both my family in a movie or even or maybe my family maybe even you know a series. I do hope that my family that day comes. I do seriously hope that day comes. And uh my family basically, you know, as I proceed my family on what my family was also said on this uh TV show called Two Mics and a Bill My Family. My family, here is also my family what my family was also said my family kindly please be able to see my family this clip if that is a no liner in a commercial enjoy what you're doing do it and i don't care if that is a no liner in a commercial exactly exactly but i think part of it was the whole reason that they they stepped back from the whole royalty thing which is a whole another right show. Yeah, i've never understood that now you just <laughs> you were born it's essentially all you accomplished but whatever so they stepped back <laughs> concept of royalty because they wanted disconnect and they wanted to live their lives right and, 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 and isn't that yes. this and that's what she does that's, that's what, what she I'm does saying. and plus they treated it as right two of them so poorly worrying about the color of the baby you know that's when it, it ended for me i've never been into the royal family anyway i don't, I don't understand, understand it either. you're not more important than megan or exactly me or exactly Enjoy exactly doing, do exactly it. i don't care if that is a no liner in a commercial but I think part of it was my family exactly enjoy what you are doing. I don't care if it's a no liner in a commercial. Enjoy what you are doing. The question is, did Megan enjoy my family? I believe her laugh at the end of that, you know, my family video for clever blend family for clever blends. Clearly, she had fun doing it and she enjoyed it and she loved it. My family doing it. So Megan must keep on doing what she loves to do, what she enjoys doing. And let nobody ever tell her, my family, you know, this is beneath you, that you shouldn't do this. Oh, you left the whole family for this. What Do what makes you happy. Megan, do what makes you happy. Don't let the naysayers who are profiting from exploiting you tell you what to do or what not to do. Like, they're making money. Whenever Megan, my family wears, you know, my family, any cloth, I have seen, as I have said, I have seen Daily Mail also promoting clothes that Megan has worn. That way, they earn a commission, my family. They know Megan's power and they're exploiting Megan's power. But they're saying Megan didn't engage in influence that could make her so much money as an influencer. They want to make money all for Meghan Markle, but they don't want Meghan to make money herself. Because still they're hoping that Harry will come out to the UK a failure with a tail between his legs, having failed. That's what my family want to see. You know, my family, it's important to be independent. It's important to have your own money. It's important, you know. Mom has a job, cool. Dad has a job, cool. They both join hands Supporting each other, supporting their family. It's important to have that, you know, my family financial independence whereby if you ever encounter any problem, you two can chip in and help each other out, my family. You know? And some individuals are trying to dissuade Meghan Markle from engaging in influencing, yet they know that's where the money is. That's how they make money off of Meghan Markle. But they don't want Megan to make any kind of money. My family, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. I don't. I don't. I want to see Megan become a billionaire. A multi-billionaire was made. You know, billions and billions of dollars. That's what I want. That's what my family, that is what I want to see my family for Megan Markle. 
and also from Prince Harry. You know? Never should they ever be at the mercy of Charles or William for money. Because if you are at their mercy, it means if Charles commands Harry to drop his cases against Wikimedia, Harry has no choice but to drop his case against Daily Mail if he wants to earn any money. He wants to be paid. And my family, that's why my family, I keep saying this, Harry and Meghan must never ever be at the mercy of Charles or William for money. You love doing what you're doing, then do it. Do what makes you happy. If it's acting, do it. If it's producing content, do it. Do what makes you happy. For me, I love, I love, you know, my family doing these YouTube videos. It makes me happy. I love doing it. Whenever I don't do it, I feel like um, I'm, I'm upset. I'm kind of sad. So I love doing it. Do what makes you happy. Do what makes you happy. Do what brings you joy and happiness. You know, my family, I love supporting Harry Maker. They're good people. I love that. It makes me happy doing it. My family. I love getting quoted. It makes me happy doing it. I love talking to you like this. It makes me happy doing it. And also, I encourage all of you, do what makes you happy. Do what is pleasing to you. Do what makes you happy. You know? Same thing to Meghan Markle. No matter how many times I've seen how carnival or so-called expert disparage Megan's achievements in her career, my family as an actress, the fact is my family, Megan had a successful career before raw marriage. The fact is Megan was a self-made millionaire before getting married. My family, that's a fact. And Megan, she loved her life. She loved traveling. My family, she loved blogging, you know, you know, you know on a blog they take. She loved that. Posting pictures of where she was, traveling with her camera, taking pictures of new places she visited. Make her love that. It was her life. My family, at one point, she even said that, you know, what was she was asked, what can't you live without? She said, her passport. She loved traveling. She enjoyed traveling different corners of the globe. My family, she loved that. So, so, so my family, you do what makes you happy. You do what brings you so much joy? And let nobody ever tell you otherwise, my family. You know? Let no naysayer ever dissuade you from doing what you want to do by telling you, you know what? This is beneath you. No. No, my family. Do what you love. Do what makes you happy. My family. And also, as I've always said, really, one of the reasons as to why this May campaign against Megan has been a failure is because of Megan's past. Before meeting Prince Harry. My family, Megan had an amazing successful career before marriage. And no matter how many times you came in and disparaged Megan's, you know, acting, my family, you know, her career before meeting Prince Harry, the fact is, my family, she lived a happy life, an independent life. My family, even in Harry's most spare, he says of Megan Markle when she saw Megan Markle. She was free. You know, I was trapped in a gilded kingdom family. Her life was an adventure. Oh, how nice it would be if I could join her in this adventure. Prince Harry, my family, said that, you know, in his memoirs, because clearly he must have seen Megan's blog, The Tig, and also Megan's post on Instagram. He said, My family, Megan, lived a life of an you know, an adventure, travel the world. She must have been, he must have been looking at Megan's Instagram and also Megan's blog, The Tig. To be able to see that, my family, and Megan, keep doing what you love to do. We'll support you. We love you. And not, don't let any naysayer tell you, you know, don't do this or that. Do what makes you and Prince Harry happy. We'll also be very, very happy. To see you and Harry happy. My family also just here. My family also. My family this last clip please my family. Of what my family was also. You know. Save my family. You know. Because we're going to have a black baby in the palace. Because we're going to have a black baby in the palace. She was so excited. 
that there was going to be a, some diversity in the palace. Well, she was excited, but the royal family. But the royal family was that, not here for it. They're not into it. Yeah. They weren't here for it. Yeah, now how dark so, is he going to be? Right. You know, shut up. So, so but I mean, at the end of the day, though, man, I think this is makes her happy, man. This dude, Harry, has to live with her. This is his wife. This is their family. Like, look, this is what you want to do, babe. Go ahead out there and do it. No, does she have to do it? No, she doesn't have to. I wonder how much she. But why hired. not enjoy life? This yeah. is what she enjoys yeah, doing. Yeah. Yeah. I ain't yeah. So don't judge you. her for enjoying life. Get out of here with that. And man. you know what? I'd go out of my way to drink the coffee. Word up. Yeah. I'm like, because if she's endorsing it, it must be pretty good coffee. Uh, darn Does right. she get the best coffee in the world? She probably never <laughs> tasted it. I know, I know. <laughs> Actually, Megan did test, you know, clever blends and she liked it. My family and also she recommended it to Oprah. So my family basically, you know, you've heard what my family he said about first of all about Beck and Mark already. Do what makes you happy. Do what pleases you. You know, keep on being independent. It's important to be independent. To have that independence, my family, financially. It's important to have that. And let nobody tell you, you know, otherwise, my family. The people who tell you, you know, don't do this, don't don't engage in this commercial venture. They don't wish well for you because they want to see you failing, not making any money. Harry and Meghan must be able to make money to pay their own bills. My family, I never be at the mercy of Charles or William for anything. Never ever be at the mercy of Charles and William for money. Never. My family. My family, you tell me. My family, you are thoughts about what? Was still my family, but also my family has been discussed. My family, I wanna please kindly hear your opinion, family. God bless Harry, Megan, Archie, and also Libertana and Doria Raglan, and all of you members of the squad at home, my family. Remember, the whole family set off on an attack on Harry and Megan, and everyone in Harry and Megan's circle, everyone in Harry and Megan's circle, even those who work with Harry and Megan. And that's why they don't want to see, you know, Megan's, you know, investment at Clever Blend succeed. They don't want to see, to see Harry and Megan making money. My family, Harry and Megan must be able to make money to pay their own bills, my family. And never be at the mercy of Charles or William for money. My family, now tell me your thoughts, my family, about what we have just discussed. God bless Harry, Megan, Archie, and also Lipetana and Doria Raglan. Hello, members of Zisco Family TV. First of all, I want to say thank you for all your support that you give us to our channel. We don't take it for granted that you support this channel. I want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts for lending out your support and fighting against injustices, supporting Prince Harry and Meghan, showing them love. Love will always triumph over evil, and for that, I say thank you. Good will always prevail over bad. Thank you so much for all your support. Thank you so much for joining this community, this amazing community of Zesco Family TV. I love you so much, family, from the bottom of my heart. And I wish you all the best. May you have a great, great day. And I hope that you enjoyed this video and learned a lot, a lot of things. With that and so much more, stay tuned to our next video. Leave a comment below, like, and subscribe. Love you, family, always and forever. Sayonara.